Okay, so for risking my life in the hardest quest we've done to date in this series, please make sure you give me something How's very disappointing as a reward. Ammo pile down there. Okay. Now let's go in here. Oh, this is where you would do the generator thingy. Zamba doodles over here. Nope. Okay, so we're clear on this side. I'm uh I'm very impressed with how challenging this is. And I don't know if Undead Legacy makes tier fives more difficult than vanilla, but Oh, that stupid buzzard gave us an abrasion. Damn it, Jim. All right. Um, but anyway, um, I, I appreciate this challenge because I just don't like games that are too damn easy, you know? And this is not easy. In fact, it is a friggin' miracle that we're alive at all, if you think about it. <laughs> After all the stuff we went through. Okay, that gets rid of another buzzard. And there's another one stuck somewhere around here. Oh! Frame rate! Hold your head still, damn it! I can't get a bead on him. Mostly due to the frame rate. Okay, well that hurt. I think this would be a good time for some more spaghetti. Okay. Yeah, I'm not even sure where those guys came from. Unless they were down on the, on the floor below us and they came back up the stairs. this loaded back up. Frames are terrible. That means there's a bunch of zombies down below. <clears throat> I only see three red dots though. So those are or four. Yeah, I only see four. Those are the ones we have to kill to beat the quest. But then there's just a bunch of random zombos that got called in by screamers or came off the street out of, you know, after us too. Looting skill has improved to level 68. Fantastic. All right. Well, I guess um, our next move is to go down this stairwell here. So let's do it. We're still getting health from the, the food, right? Yeah, it's just slowly creeping up. Why don't we take one of these also? Okay, that brings us down to here. Have we have we already been in this room though? Pretty sure we have, haven't we? Why is it leading us down here though? Well, maybe we haven't been in this room. Okay, I guess they want us to go back onto the ledge again. 
Easy does it. Easy does it. Really like to get that vulture out of here. He's gonna sneak up on me. Ah, oh, okay, this is where it wants us to go. So I think we probably have been down. Okay, that gets rid of him. I think we have been in this room. On this floor. I'm almost positive that we have been. Okay, so let's jump up here. And you want us to parkour that ladder. Uh, Alright. We did it. And then head down this way. Now, once we drop down here, can we still get back up here? We have to. Yes, we can. Okay. This is sketchy. Let's um put that there for just a moment. It's not going to buy us more than a second or two, but it'll buy us a second or two. The question is, are there any zombos on this floor here? I'm gonna say probably not because if there were there might be sleepers that we haven't woken up I don't think there's any active Zeeks on this floor they probably would have come to us by now Arbucks Okay, so our plan here is to retreat back to here and up that ladder, and then up that ladder, and fight the zombies um, on the ladder. I don't know if that's the best plan in the world, but it's the plan. Sneaking skill has improved to 37. Look at that. Let's go left. Can't tell what that is. Alright, Zombo just woke up down there. Do they have a way to get up to this floor? Not that I can currently see, but that doesn't mean there isn't a way. Now let's go this way. Okay, have some more bookshelves in here. What do we get? One dollar make you holla. Go back this way. Just a smidge. Just a gnat's eyebrow. Quarter of a gnat's eyebrow. All for two cans. Still don't see anybody up on this floor yet. Uh, 
Uh, there's no point in being quiet at this juncture. Okay, so that's where we were there. We could do the same trick that we did before. Uh, that we did up there. We only have 16 blocks left, though. No, let's let's not do that at this point. I'm pretty sure we've already aggroed all the Zeeks on this floor at some point in this whole entire adventure here. Check this room over here in this corner. Bullets, hinges, no desk safes though, or wall safes. It is noon. Okay, so we've uh, cleared floor two. Got a lots of Zeeks down there. That guy doesn't even know we're out and about. Um, okay, so what are we supposed to... Where do we go from here? We came in here. And I didn't notice the way down, but I wasn't looking for it either. So let's look around again. I wonder if they expect us to to just jump down here. That's probably what we're supposed to do. Either that or I missed a window that we can go out somewhere. Oh, like here maybe? Oh, no. I think we broke that out earlier. Yeah, we did. I didn't open this guy up. Okay, so I'm. I think we need to go down there. Um, if we could group these guys up and kill them, that would be a good plan. Well, he sees us now. What if we made a murder hole? Right down here. Hmm. All right. How do I get all these guys to congregate right below me here? Got a spider. I guess there's a few of them down there. Let's go ahead and drop some bombs on them. Oh, sh oh, come on, really? It's the lag. It was the lag. Um. Okay, we'll be safe down here. Not. Oh, shit. We've already been down here, right? Um. Okay. Run, 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 run. Time for beer. Can we get out through here? Yeah, we can. Okay, good. Okay, so, yeah, that was, um, not an ideal scenario. Nope. Can't 
Can't get on those when there's one right behind you. It just doesn't work very well. Okay. You know, this could maybe work in our favor for starting to get some of these guys killed off here. I'd like to stop here real quick and oh no I don't have to stop here let's take one of these too so we're gonna be doing some footwork we need to be as tough as possible he did Let's do a reload. Oh, he's coming in fast. Yowzers. Couldn't get up over the thing. get uh, irradiated fatso. He's the most dangerous. Okay, I think he's dead. The biker's tough as hell, too. Alright. We're still alive. There is that. Why don't we take one of these? And, um, guess, let's see if we can kill off any more Zeeks that are around. He is dead, right? Yeah. You know what? If there's that many of you in there, take one of those. All right. We're actually not doing super bad. Probably not really super good either, but not super bad. Let's check these books while we can. Wait. Yeah. Empty. Okay. Super disappointing. Not surprising, though. The bookstore used to be such a good place to go to get schematics, and it's just pathetic now for that reason. It's still a neat POI, though. Um, yeah, you know what? We might as well grab all of these. We still have more Zeeks to kill, because obviously we haven't finished the quest. That's probably where we're supposed to go next, I think. So yeah, I think, I think it wanted us to jump down to here, and then do this floor, and then we go down there next, but let's finish uh, looting here. Okay. Anything else? Sync action there. We actually, oh yeah, we went down that way and closed the hatch. 
so that means there's two ways down, but one of those could have possibly been, uh, you know, broken open by the Zombos. Okay, well, let's go, let's go this way. Oh, so this is where the, the printing press room is now. This used to be up high. Now they actually got it down in the basement. Is that a corpse or an Edgar? Must be a corpse. Okay. So let's start looking around. That is not a lootable uh, thingy. We don't have any red dots left on the compass. Let's go look around over here. Got a box here. Nice. We'll take that research data. That's one of the other Jennies that you got to do if you do the power quest. Oh, is that the fat loot room? That is the fat loot room. Okay. We know there's going to be more Zeeks though because we haven't we haven't finished this quest yet. What's the matter with me? Oh, I'm thirsty. All right, let's take one of these. And let's take a gumbo stew this time, because that'll give us a food and water. Um, you know what? Screw that cement. I don't care about that right now. Reload this guy. Hmm. So, if there's no zombies in the fat loot room, where are the remaining zombies that we have to kill? I don't know, but you know what? Since we're here, let's do it. Let's take an eye candy. And we will have to pop a jailbreakers for this one. It's right up there. Look at that. Okay. A B level ranger rifle, which we already have. Um, if we compare this one with the new one we just looted, which is, wait a minute, did we not pull it out of there? No, we didn't. There. This one has 0.1 more firing range and three more meters of range, or I'm sorry, fire rate and range, but it's 4.6 less on the damage is I can't I can never remember if this is counting mods or not modify okay now let's compare <laughs> yeah I don't think it was taken into account um, mod so so our current range rifle is still the better one just barely just barely the better one okay okay let's grab the rest of these items recog oh there's my crossbow bolt can i get it can i get it right 
uh, there. Nice. Let's check these boxes here. Turn that into research data. Um, sure, why not? We'll learn that and we will, of course, scrap that for more research data. Okay, so we've actually finished the fat loots. Oh, yeah, this is the ramp that we ran down several times, so we definitely um, aggroed all those guys a long time ago. Let's check this crack of I uh, don't care about a scrap sledgehammer. I already have those, um, the actual mod themselves. Okay, so we just have to figure out where the remaining Zeekers are that need to be killed. If we're lucky, it's just a couple of stragglers somewhere. And, um, well, that, that chicken scared the hell out of me. I'm going, what was that? Um, there's just a couple stragglers somewhere and not like a whole nother group of them. Um, did we, I don't know if we ever, did we come into this area? I don't remember. Okay. Now let's go back this way. This comes into here. But that doesn't, uh, get us anywhere. Um, I could put a block down and nerd up, nerd up, but let's just go back up the stairs. You know, there were, now that I think about it, there were some zombos that at one point had gone across the street and had gotten up on that other building. But the thing is, I don't see any red dots anywhere. So I guess what we'll do is we'll just run around We'll hit every floor again, kind of backtrack until we find the remaining zombie or Z's, zombies, zombies. Nobody behind here. Oh, we got some rocket part fittings. Okay. All right. I'm just going to go up the the stairwell to get to the next floors rather than trying to fight it. Pretty sure we've already been in here, right? Yeah, that's all empty. Okay, we can use that to get up to the next floor if we so choose. I know we've been in all of those rooms. Okay. But this skips some floors. So, yeah, let's not do that. Let's just go keep going up the stairwell because that way we know for sure we're hitting every floor along the way. This is a floor we started with. Okay. 
Okay, we know we can get up to the next level just going up here. Oh shit! I think we found him. Return to Trader. We did it. <laughs> Woo! Oh my goodness. That was an ordeal, you guys. That was an ordeal, but we got her done. Okay. Wow. Um, Just curious. Can we take these apart? And if we do, do we get anything good from them? Okay, I probably won't be doing that again. That took a long time for very little reward. Um, What room was it that we aggroed those guys in? Because we've already looted all this, all these rooms, haven't we? Yeah, we've already been through all here. I, I don't know, maybe they, at some point, were partially damaged, but we didn't kill them all the way, and then they reset in their sleeper position. That's probably what happened there. All right, you guys. Um, we are finished with our first Tier 5 quest, and boy, oh boy, was that a fight. And I'm really actually pretty doggone lucky to be alive <laughs> through all of that. There was more than one time when I thought, okay, that's it. We're going down. Uh, but we managed to, to make it happen somehow. Um, so yay us, right? So what I'm going to do is meet you guys back at the trader for what will probably be a very disappointing turn in, and then we'll wrap up this episode. So I'll see you back at the trader. Hopefully we can get back there in time. I think we can. We're going to stop off at Jen's here really quick. One of you guys told me in the comments you thought that maybe her vending machine sells the uh, well, aren't you a poison antidote. Ah, oh, it does. What thank you, thank you, thank you to whoever it was that told me that. We finally got some antidotes back. We need to hang on to one of those to, to make the recipe for it, too. Um, let's get one of those. We don't need chicken ration. We don't really need any of the rest of that stuff. Uh, okay, let's check her inventory really quick. Um, we don't need acid. Do, 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 do. Beakers. We need beakers. For buying them. I think we needed that to, to upgrade the Kimbench. Fantastic. Okay. Um, anything else? Nothing really here. Let's look at secret stash. Yeah, we need that. Oh, finally! I have been waiting forever for this. This will allow us to finally make our own steel crossbow bolts instead of having to rely upon buying them. That was a good find. Uh, car wheel. Nah, I don't think we need that. Steel katana. Don't care about that so much. And yeah, good. All right. That was that was good. That was really Thank good. Thank you so much. Hey, come again. We can now finally make our own steel crossbow bolts. Let's go check uh, what's his name up here. Yaden Let's Hayden. Let's trade. Ray Hagen. All right, what do you got, man? What's that? A misshaped junk blade. No thanks. Nothing really there. Sniper volume 7. Definitely want that. And we don't really care so much about bar brawling. Timed charges. Those aren't landmines. Here's some rocket fuses. Why don't we... But how much are those? 127? Let's buy those. Um, because we found some casings earlier too. Good luck. Um, can we use these? Okay. That's to make the actual rocket launcher itself, though. 
Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm still a little bit corn fuzzled about how that works. I think we have to find the schematic to make the rockets themselves. Not the rocket launcher, but the rockets themselves. If I'm interpreting that correctly. Okay, let's get on back to our trader before it gets too late so we can get this turn in done. Okay, so we're risking my life in the hardest quest we've done to date in this series. Please make sure you give me something How's very disappointing me, as a reward. You can freeze Here's first. Reward. Um. Okay. See, the thing about this is it sucks compared to what we have now. But we could upgrade it. And eventually maybe turn it into something better than what we have now. Uh, I think we may already have a military helmet anyway, so I'm not interested in that. Plus, this is 728 versus 527. So we get 15,000 XP and 4,600 dukes. I mean, okay, that wasn't as disappointing as it could have been, but it was still kind of disappointing. All right, jobs. Fetch and clear at Chamway Factory. Um, I'm, I'm actually stoked to do all of these, you guys, because... Um, Deshong, Deshong, and maybe Higashi. I think we didn't we do Higashi at the end of the vanilla season, and now the library are the are the only ones that I've actually done in Alpha Twenty. So I haven't done the new Shamway factory, and I can't remember that Pop and Pills factory. That's that's got to be something new. I have a dilemma and could use some assistance. Yeah, that is new. Because we used to just have Shaka, Messiah, and Shamway. Okay, we're doing this. This is going to be completely man. brand new. Brand new, new, new. All right, you guys. Wowzers. That was crazy. That was one heck of a crazy... These guys must have reset. Um, Crazy POI that we just did. Grab the peas. We'll grab these. We'll grab these. Uh... Skull crushers. I think we have plenty of skull crushers. Chicken soup. I don't think that has a recipe. I think it's the soups. This one is the one that has a recipe. Okay. So, yeah. That is it, guys, for this episode. Um, I am probably going to have to split this up into multiple episodes because I have at least three hours of recording time. Since I started this morning up until now, I had to stop for a little bit, um, go do some stuff in real life. But yeah, so I'll probably not not that that matters to you because you you will know this by the time it happens. But um, we'll definitely gonna have to split this up because it was just a very long recording, but it was fun. We did good, and I'm happy that we survived. Um, <laughs> I I can't believe we survived, but we did, and I'm happy that we did. So yeah, those tier fives are no joke. All right, guys, that's it for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, I will catch you in the next episode where we will... I don't know what we'll do. I need i need to get some stone farmed up off camera uh, because I still want to build out our garage. So, you know, I'll probably... Which I went too far. I'll probably work on that a little bit. i got to go get some more gas out of the desert. That's also going to be most likely an off-camera thing. And, um, and then when we come back in the next episode, the tentative plan will be for us to work on our garage and go from there. Okay, so... Again, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share the video. And we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.